Hello again, and in this video, we're going to be looking at inflating our SUP board and getting it to the right pressure. So what we want to do is we want to get out our SUP board and lay it on the ground nice and flat. So we're going to remove the valve cap and check that the valve spring is springy and not locked into place. If it is locked into place, a quarter turn anti-clockwise will help bring it back out and take our hose. Attach our hose to the outlet of our sub pump. Then we're going to take the other end of the hose half a turn anti-clockwise before we put it in the valve. What this will do is stop the pump detaching itself while you're inflating your board. So while we're pumping up our board we want to make sure that we're going to use our legs more than our back to stop all those aches and pains. When the pump does get too difficult continue on a single action for much easier operation. So once you've reached your recommended PSI, as indicated on the back of your board around the valve, twist your hose off anti-clockwise, you'll hear a little hiss of air rushing out. That's fine, that's just the valve closing up once you're finished. And that is how we inflate our McConk board up to the recommended PSI, and you're almost ready to get out on the water. Thank you for watching this video, please go ahead and check out the McConk's website, for more beginner paddling tips, surfboards, paddles and accessories.